Hi students, how are you? I think you are all fine and enjoying this digital class. Do you know what is this digital class? A learning through multimedia. This is the expectation of Isaac Asimov and we are going to learn in this lesson also. In India, in ancient days, students went to Gurugula to learn. There they lived with their guru in his ashram and served him and learnt. Nowadays, we are going to school, teachers come there and we learn. But in ancient days, the students have to go to the teacher's ashram. They have to serve him and then they learn. Later, students went to the teacher's home and studied. It was called Tinnai Pallikudam. Then a small change came in the education system. Noble Awadi Rabindranath Chagur opened Shantiniketan. There, students learned according to their interests. If he wants to learn drawing, he can learn in a separate area. And if he wants to learn dance or language, literature, likewise, he can learn everything according to his interest. Now, students and teachers come to a common place named school, college, university. Now, you are all studying in schools, enjoying learning. The teacher is teaching you and you are learning very interestingly. And if you have any doubt, you can ask him at any time. He will clarify your doubts. See this picture. Have you ever seen these things to read and write? It is something different. We are using pen, pencil likewise. These are used in olden days by our ancestors. We are amazed to see this. Am I right? A yeah, machine. The machine will teach them. I think they could clarify their doubts with the machine. I do not know. But they will be surprised to learn to know our this methodology. This is the story of the fun they had, which was written by Isaac Asimov. Do you know about Isaac Asimov? He was born on 2nd January 1920. He was a biochemistry professor in Boston University. He was also known for science fiction. He had written more than 90,000 letters and postcards during his lifetime. He was one of the best science fiction writers during his period. Fiction means a story which will happen in future days, in future times. Margi, 11 years old girl. Tommy, 13 years old boy. Margi's mother, Mrs. Jones. County inspector. A round little man with a red face. Then mechanical teacher. First of all, now we see the new words of this story. Crinkly, full of wrinkles. Crinkly means full of wrinkles. Example, she wore a crinkly green silk sari. Attic, a space within the roof of a house. 
he kept his old books in the attic scornful feeling or expressing contempt scornful feeling or expressing contempt he looked at his son with a scornful look on his face see the picture the father looked at his son scornfully awfully very badly england player sam karan played awfully throughout the game he didn't play well century a period of 100 years alexander graham bell was born in the 19th century loftily something done in a proud manner he loftily dismissed my words as meaningless fun enjoyment they said that they had a great fun in the get together party mechanical teacher a computer device able to teach children the children loved learning with the help of a mechanical teacher nonchalantly in a calm manner often in a way that suggests you are not interested or do not care see the picture how the girl is sitting she does not care anybody example she leaned back and crossed her long legs nonchalantly okay now we see the story margi had a habit of writing diary on 17th may 2157 she wrote in her diary today tommy found a real book students imagine we are traveling to the year 2157 we are going to meet margi a girl of 11 years old every day she will write a diary at night one day she wrote in her diary tommy found a real book because they haven't seen any real book they have seen only tele books imagine now we are going to travel to the year 2157 now what are you doing to write you take your note and write your uh, homeworks and uh, lessons do sums but in the year 2157 the students will learn through e books okay another one question do you have a habit of writing diary it is a good habit which recollects our memories of the day likewise the main character of this story margi has a habit of writing diary every night she will write on 17th may 2157 she writes in her diary today tommy found a real book the book is a old one margi's grandfather once had told her that when he was a child his grandfather had told about the books in the book all stories were printed on a paper when tommy found the book the book was yellow and crinkly because it was very old he felt that it was very funny to read the book margi asked her, tommy if it is real tommy said that 
it was a waste thing studying a book and threw it away our television screen must have had a millions of book on it now we are studying using books you know if we have any doubt we open the book and read the example and we can clarify and we can rectify our doubts if we could not understand our lessons we go to our teacher and clarify our doubts but tommy feels that reading a book is a waste thing because he had seen many books in his television screen margi asked tommy where he had found the book he replied in the attic then margi asked him what it was about about school tommy replied in the attic of my house i have already explained you the meaning of the word attic on hearing this margi want to know what the book is about he says the book is about school now what we are doing in the school what we are learning in the school that is printed in the book on hearing this about the school the word on hearing the word about the school margi becomes scornful she asks what's that to write about the school because she hates school is there anything special to write about school why margi hates school do you know her mechanical teacher gives test after test in geography she scores low marks so she hates she is learning through mechanical teacher not like us we are teaching and you are learning if you have any doubt we clarify you but margi learns through mechanical teacher she doesn't like the school in her home so she hate the school not our school though margi's mother scolds her she thinks that it may the fault of the mechanical teacher she calls county inspector see the picture how he is he is a round little man he has a whole box of tools with dials and wires so inspector comes to her home to her school he smiles at morgi he gives her an apple and then took the teacher for service morgi is very happy because the inspector will take a long time to repair the machine and he will not know how to put it together again so it will become late why she is happy once tommy's mechanical teacher didn't work properly inspector came and took away the mechanical teacher with him and he returned it only after a month she is also expecting the same to be happen repairs 
it within an hour and makes it correct. Now the mechanical teacher starts working properly. He said that it is not her fault, it is not Margie's fault. The geography sector is geared a little too quickly. Margie's average performance is quite satisfactory. She has done her works well. Her performance is very nice. On hearing this, Margie is happy. She has to study today itself. So, she was disappointed. Tommy was happy without mechanical teacher for a month. But Margie, the mechanical teacher, was repaired within an hour and it worked properly. So, she was disappointed. Okay. Now, we, we are writing homeworks with pen or pencil in our notes. Whatever the teacher gives as homework, we are writing that in our notes. But in 2157, how will the students write their homeworks? Whether they write with pen in their notes? No. See these pictures. In this picture, you are seeing books and notes. And nearby, another picture. See the picture? They are punched in a paper. Why these punching codes are used? These are used, these are going to be used in 2157 to write homework. Yes, Margie is writing her test using these punch codes. Her parents has made her to learn to use this punch code when she was 6 years old. After using these punch codes, writing her test, she will put the papers into the slot where she has to put her homeworks. The mechanical teacher will quickly correct the papers, the punch codes and gives marks. Margie asks Tommy to tell about old schools because he is senior. He is 13 years old. So, as he is elder, she asks and also Tommy has read the book. So, she asked Tommy to tell about schools. Tommy says, in olden days, there was a special common building where both students and teachers went there. Students, I am telling about us. We are now in 2157. At that time, Tommy tells about our schools. Now, what you are doing? You are coming from your home to our school and you learn in the classroom we are teaching and you are learning. We are all uh, clarifying your doubts. Tommy says like this about schools. He particularly says about the teacher. The teacher is a human being, not like us. The mechanical teacher, there won't be any mechanical teacher. Our school is in our home, but 
in the olden days the school is a special separate building the teacher will teach he will give homework and ask question likewise margi and uh, tommy are discussing about old schools in the meantime margi's mother called her to attend school because it is the time to study and also advises tommy to go to his school margi does not want to go to her school he want to know more about the books real books so she asks tommy if she could read the book with him later tommy also accepts her request and whistling he goes to his home to attend his class margi goes to her school the school of margi margi goes into her classroom the mechanical teacher is waiting for her to teach on that day the teacher is ready to teach her addition of proper fraction in arithmetic but she is physically present there in front of the mechanical teacher but mentally absence she thinks of old schools that is she thinks of you how you enjoy in schools and how you play together at your free time see the picture how they come running happily she thinks of this and sitting together in the classroom going home together at the end of the day see the students they are studying in the classroom if they had any doubt they will ask one another and clarify their doubts if they couldn't understand they will ask the teacher for their doubts so margi is thinking of this type of schools we are emotionally connected but for margi it's not possible a mechanical teacher could not understand her feelings if she is present or not if she has concentration on the lesson on the subject she is interested to learn the particular subject so she also wants to enjoy the class like you she feels and longs for the old schools the fun you are having in your lifetime the golden memories of your lifetime so margi loves our present education system okay children which is the best mechanical teacher or a human being this is what margi feels she loves our present day education system i think you will have understand this story completely now we go for the recall now i am going to ask few questions to know how you have understand this story what did margi write in her diary how old was margi where did tommy find the book how was the old book what was the old book about where was margi school why did margi hate school what did margi expect how did margi write in her test when did margi learn to use punch code what did tommy say about old school find out the answers 
Thank you students.